Yeah. So the reason I don't like Dina is because of this. So I don't, I didn't really, don't like the writing of her when it comes to, um, like how she was with Jesse. And then obviously it was like, Jesse's like, oh, it's been a week since they broke up. And then she's kind of like acting like she's madly in love with Ellie. Like Ellie's the best thing that's ever happened to her. Like she's like, oh, if you go, I go. Yeah. Yeah, and I don't know, but it just seems. Yeah, that just seems kind of fake to me. Shit. Yeah. There's someone living here. Well, there was. Yeah, it just seems, seems kind of fake to me. Um, and the only reason that I could really think of as to why it's written like that, because I think she, I would like her so much better if she was like Ellie's long-term girlfriend, so they've been dating for like a year or two before the game actually starts. Um... But yeah, oh, what's that? But yeah, the reason why I think they've done it like that is because of the pregnancy thing. Because obviously Ellie can't get pregnant. Uh, Ellie can't get Dina pregnant, obviously. Um, and I was like, well, why is that significant? And I think it's one, it's kind of stops her, uh, Dina, from coming with you on this vengeance shit. Um, so you have to do it on your own. Because games love to do that. They love to give you a companion and then just take them away at some point. Um, so that's, that's that. Um, but also, um, recently as well, I've been thinking about it still. Um, and I think, um, I think there's a part that comes later on, which is more significant as to why they've done it as they've done it. Because I was just like, if it's because, um, they don't want Ellie to be, um, you don't want her to be coming with you to fuck people up. Then I was like, they, she could have been injured, either, you know, maybe in that chase running away from the infected, um, or maybe the WLF or a SCAR or whatever, because we haven't met the SCARs yet. Maybe um, a WLF member uh, injured her and that's why she can't go with you. But I think uh, the, the thing that comes later um is why they decided to make her pregnant but yeah um that as well i i just don't think her and ellie have much chemistry at all as a couple uh they don't really seem to know much about each other and i don't know they just yeah they just don't seem like a good match to me um so yeah every time when dina and ellie call each other babe i'm just like oh for fuck's sake <laughs> uh yeah it's a shame because i think that it would have been really cute if ellie had like a really cute little girlfriend um yeah that's kind of why i would like to know more about cat because they only mention her very briefly um and obviously she was the artist who did ellie's tattoo but then you never hear about her again so like is she dead what happened there? Were her and Ellie dating? Did Ellie just have a crush on her? You know, I don't know. But I would, I would have liked to learn more about Cat, honestly. But yeah, I was stood here because this is the shit where we've got to go. Um, September thirteenth. I don't think they're coming back. Crossed out. They're not coming back. Either got ambushed or they ditched me. Not my fault. I got sick. At least the fever's gone. But now I'm fucking starving. Can probably raid the buildings nearby for food then see if i can raid raise someone on the radio september 15th constant rains means i at least won't die of thirst uh unfortunately it keeps making the electricity conk out all the time makes it kind of hard to use a radio not like anyone's answering anyway the wlf can't have hit all the federal listening posts no way I need to keep trying uh, september 16th Dreamt they were laughing as I slowly bled out from a gut shot. Woke up an hour ago, still shaking. Need a cigarette. You think they? Do you think there'd be a pack or two stashed somewhere in a fucking theatre? But apparently not this one. September nineteenth. Uh, Power went out again. Going to head to the roof and see if I can get it back on. Yeah, and there's that note downstairs as well that I want to go back and read. So I'm actually do that now because I don't know if it um, fucks up with the like the, a cutscene or something, I think it does. 
Let's have a look. September 4th, me, Perez, Green, and Adams made it to the listening post two days ago, and so far, so good. WLF hasn't come looking here yet. The city's lost the WLF. We escaped headquarters out of sheer luck and good timing. Torres, Ward, and the others are probably dead. Torres is definitely dead. We saw his corpse. Uh, camping here, grateful to be alive for now. Sextem September? September 6th. Can't sleep, burning up with a fever, no medicine. Looked everywhere. We don't have anything except the uniforms on our backs. No contact from anyone on the radio either. How many of us made it out? Uh, September 7th. Still feverish. Don't have any big cuts, so probably not an infection. The others are waiting until nightfall and making a run to the hospital to get medicine for me and supplies for, when, for wherever we're going next. They're good guys. September 10th. It shouldn't be taking this long. Oh, that's so ironic. I like how he literally wrote their good guys and then it's so like... here a while back. Yeah. Hope no one else is here. Yeah, and then it's like, oh, they left him. Which, honestly, I can understand. I mean... They could have got ambushed, because, like, especially with a hospital, we're going to find out that hospitals are not, are not a good place. <laughs> but, yeah. Come on, Ellie, let's go. Oof. I want to say we'll have a look at him now. Damn. Mm-hmm. You get fried? Yeah. Guess you weren't much of an electrician. No, guess not. Got it. Nice. Well, I guess we'll just leave that spark in. Oh, wrong one again. Some keys. This. All right. All right. So, I guess there are locked doors here somewhere. Oh, right. Actually, I think there's one literally right here. Yeah. <laughs> Joel, you'd love watching a movie in this place. Oh. <sighs> yeah, I bet he would. Oh, here we go. The sick habit. Rat. Rat. Twenty-five dollars at the door. Um, set list. Start off a less, who can say, once more unto the breach. Hide out, running towards my problems. Who the fuck runs towards the problems? Possession, the light of two minds. Encore! Nice. <sighs> Spooky. Yeah, that angle really makes it look like someone's going to come out and just absolutely no bash you. I mean, it, it would make sense that they'd have a guitar in a theatre, right? Surely you take your bag off. Like, sitting in that seat would be a lot more comfortable without a massive bag on.
Well, here we fucking go again. Oops. <laughs> it's so sad. Ah, oh, I missed her all already. Sound like something. Oh, I suck. Nah. Just need to build up your calluses, that's all. Yeah. All right, come on. Does it? Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, Joel. <laughs> I'm going to start guessing. You want to spoil your surprise now? Oh, no. Is it a dinosaur? Stop trying to guess. I ain't telling you. <sighs> All right. Is it an elephant? <sighs> Is it a convertible? You're not going to guess. Is it a puppy? Is it a lion? No walking, less talking. Thank you, Joel. Step. I got it. Oops. Ah! <laughs> Such a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> what is wrong with you? You should see your face right now. What if I drown? No, you're not gonna drown. You gotta work on that confidence, kiddo. <laughs> yeah, keep laughing, old man. See what happens. This way. You're worse. Oh come on, Joel wouldn't let you Swimming drown. Better. Remember now, don't just flail about. You got the water with your whole arm. Blah blah blah. Glad to know <laughs> I'm getting through. Hey, look, come here. Take a look at this. See that deer over there? Where? Just through there. Look. Yeah. I see it. Yeah. Looks like. <laughs> How's that feel? Uh, refreshing. Yeah, it's not nice getting pushed in, is it? Well, actually, we need to swim through this part anyway. <laughs> I got you back. You're angry and upset. <laughs> I am very angry and upset. Now, come on. <laughs> oh, that's so cute. That's so cute together. You're gonna need to dive under here. Take a deep breath. Yeah, I got this. Here we go. Joel. Don't headbutt me, please. <sighs> Honestly, these flashbacks just rub salt in the wound. Is it my sixth grade history teacher wanting to apologize for being a massive dick? I beg your pardon? <laughs> my friend and I would argue whenever he called the fireflies Paris. We got a lot of detention. You know, you really need to stop letting people rile you up. Says you. Dicks. Point still stands. All right, got another dive over here. Where are you taking me? Is that a dive? Well, yeah, I guess the game won't let me go otherwise, but that didn't look like a dive. Not for Ellie, Is anyway. It, uh, a new pair of sneakers? How many of those do you have? Not enough. 
You good, Joel? Help me. Here. Okay. Fuck it. I'm done guessing. Well, I mean, good. you've guessed loads. <laughs> but, like, well, good. is it a massive comic book collection? No, wait. A new DVD collection? <sighs> yes. <laughs> Listen, which one? Just, yes. How about laser discs? I heard that's a thing. Uh, holy <laughs> shit, Joel. <laughs> it's a dinosaur. Oh my god, it is a dinosaur! And it is. Joel! Surprise. Oh, <laughs> shit. Oh, it's a motherfucking dinosaur. Can I, I... Can you climb up this? I remember thinking that you can. Yeah, here we go. What are you doing? I'm climbing! Uh, Ellie, be, be careful. I'm Climb riding a dinosaur. dinosaur! Yeah, I can see that. Just don't die falling off of one. I'm riding a T-Rex, dude. Look Come on. I'm on a motherfucking dinosaur! <laughs> whoa, 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 what are you doing? Don't jump. Just climb down. I can jump. Can I? Ah! Hey, hey! <laughs> oh, did you see that? Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> He's oh, like, I had a heart awesome. attack. It's awesome that you didn't break anything. Oh, that was awesome. Bye, dinosaur. <laughs> He looks very pleased with himself. What's this? Uh, it's a book? <sighs> it's a dinosaur book. Mm, okay. All right. Are you coming, Joel? Oh, man. <laughs> you want to try it on? I do not. <laughs> yes. Oh, look at those talons. That is a velociraptor. Actually, it's a D Dionenicus. Dionenicus. Pretty sure these are velociraptors. Yeah. I mean, at least that's what they called them in this movie I saw. Hmm. A Dino Ninicus, or whatever the fuck Ellie said. <laughs> Can we loot shit behind here? No. What about in here? Oh! <clears throat> oh, hello. Sorry, the dinosaurs are busy right now. <laughs> oh, wait. One of the dinosaurs is here. <laughs> Oh, I love Ellie. <laughs> yeah, it's no, I get it. Yeah. Ancient, it's ancient. <laughs> Go on, Joel. I'm, I'm still behind you. What the hell is this? Little dinosaur party. Compo, com, compsognathus. Well. Compsognathus. Oh wow, I got it right. It's a big name for little guys. Yeah, they'd swarm you. Oh, did you see that in a movie too? Actually, yeah, but a different one. See, there's a sequel. Oh yeah. It wasn't as good. The sequels are never as good, Joel. And this one only isn't as good as the first because. Well, because of you. <laughs> Joel, look. That is a hat on a dinosaur. It is a hat it's on a, a dinosaur. <laughs> oh, Ellie's amazing. 
I'll take that back. Thank you very much. Hey, is this going to be a thing? Yeah. Please don't let it be a thing. It's the thing. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, come on, Joel. You like to see the hat on a dinosaur. You know it. Oh. Hey, Joel. Ellie. <laughs> Don't you dare take it off. My birthday, my rules. <laughs> Looks good on you. Put a hat on your companion. Whoa, this one's brain was the size of a walnut. No, no way. Looks like you two have something in common. <laughs> oh, <laughs> good one. <laughs> oh, the jokes are flying. Triceratops means three-horned face. You would not want to be on the business end of that horn. No. These guys? Can we talk about these guys? Ceratops. This is one I recognize. You didn't recognize a big T Rex outside? Oh, you didn't recognize a Stegosaurus either? They're pretty popular. Come on. Oh, uh, Bronchiosaurus. Or is it Brachiosaurus? I don't fucking know. Let's see what Ellie says. Brachiosaurus ate oh. 600 pounds of plants a day. Whew. Imagine the poops! Uh, Ellie! Yeah, one scene where uh, actually one of the guys said, that's a big mound of shit. <laughs> 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 what is this movie and when can we see it? Tell you what, when we get back to Jackson, movie night. That's a big mound of shit. <laughs> oh, what's this? Um, Demi Tr Demi Troden. The Dime Trodon was an apex predator. What's an apex predator? The most badass predator. Huh. Pretty short for that. Wait, were you talking about me? I think you don't know what an apex predator is, Joel. Gallimimus's name means chicken mimic. I, who names these? Scientists. Well, they're dumb. Yeah, they are dumb. Let's see. Oh, I remember this one as well. What they called? The club, the club one. Oh, it's another hat. <laughs> Come on, Ellie. Look, we're twins now, Joel. No, you, you for not saying you want for saying you didn't want it on, you look pretty fucking happy. I'm just gonna say that. What's this? Ov Ov Raptor. Whoa, this one looks like a bird. Well, actually, paleontologists believe that birds were descended from dinosaurs. Well, excuse me, Mr. Professor. <laughs> I happen to know a thing or two. From a movie. Keep going. Hey, it could have been a documentary. Joel could be into documentaries. I don't think he is, but he could be. Oh, what's this? Oh, T-Rex. Look how thick this one's skull is. Kind of looks like Tommy. <laughs> I'm telling him you said that. Please don't. Get you in the right light. Boom, Tommy. Yeah. We got Allo Allosaurus, Iguanodon, and Velociraptor. Velociraptor. Joel. This is uh, the one you were talking about, the Velociraptor? So small. Well, don't trust the movies, I guess. Well, no, compared to the fucking giant. Ellie could literally sleep in that. 
it's that big. What have we got here? Footprints? Yeah, but I can't, literally can't tell what the fuck they say. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you good, Joel? You having fun? At the museum? Let's say we don't we can go there. Upstairs it is. Come on, Joel. Come on. Let's see, exit, exhibit entrance. Did you go to museums a lot? Yeah. Yeah, Sarah loved them. I swear that girl dragged me to every damn museum in Texas. Oh, it looks like it's smiling. Looks like a giraffe. Yeah, it does, doesn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I see the appeal. <laughs> Told you. <laughs> oh, and here we go. Probably the one thing that he actually... The, mo the biggest attraction that I wanted to bring her here for. Come on, Joel. <gasps> Did you know this was here? Oh, you don't like it. Um, we can head back. Huh? <laughs> oh, shut up. <laughs> oh, Joel. You're such a little dog. Joel, guess what the first animal to go to space was? Fruit flies. Oh, I have to guess that was a monkey. No, it was fruit flies. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in 1947. It was to see radiation exposure at high altitudes. They lived through it. Dead gum girl, you are smart. Dead gum girl? <laughs> Did they become super fly? What? No. It's a joke, Ellie. Whoa. Tell me another fun fact. Hmm. Astronauts say the moon smells like gunpowder. That is a fun fact. Well, wait, how would they... Sp oh, well, they would take the moon samples back inside and... Sniff them. Later, I guess. <laughs> Sniff them later. Okay, what's next? You tell me. Uh, quiz me. <laughs> I don't know. Who was the first person in space? Oh, it's easy. Yuri Gagarin. Gagarin? Is that... Gagarin? I don't know how you say it. I've only read it, so... Anyway, he flew to space on April 12th, 1961. Color me impressed. Yeah, she's literally how pulling out... How many books have you read about this? Come on, Joel. Isn't that incredible? Why don't you tell me what you like about it? Hmm... I don't know. People in your time... They... Had it easy. Hmm. <laughs> I guess relatively speaking, sure. I mean, they didn't need to go to space, but they did it anyway. It's... Ballsy. Hmm. <laughs> ballsy. Alright, kiddo. Now I get it. Yeah. Hey, did you know that the heat shields of space shuttles are made of sand? I did not. I it was some kind of thick rubber. Nope. Sand. You're welcome. Sand. I just love that. Dab gun go, you smart. <laughs> God damn. It's such a hillbilly thing to say. Come on, Ellie, tell us more facts about space. Or we can just ride in this rover car, Mars thing. Oh, fuck yeah. Fuck yeah. Where's the steering wheel? Rovers don't use steering wheels. They use joysticks. Huh. Hang on. Just the real one. Well, considering they left the real ones on the moon, I would say no. <laughs> Mm 
one there. Oh, damn! Oh, that's what she was drawing. Alright, let's read it. Tommy and Joel. Farming rotation blows. I don't get why people ask for this assignment. Note to self, talk to Maria about how early I can sign up for patrol training. Dina and I found this cool old camp to ground today. She said kids used to go there in the summers for fun. We found all these art supplies. She cut coloured paper and made some crowns for us while it rained outside. It was a good day. Jesus Christ, there's people making noise outside. It sounded like one of them just choked. Uh, anyway, uh, Joel said he's taking me on a camping trip next week for my birthday. He found something he said I'll love. He's acting very proud of himself. Smug old fogey. <laughs> oh, there we go. Cat sat next to me at movie night. Our elbows keep touching. I think she was doing it on purpose. I don't know. Maybe not. Probably not. Dina made me a crown for my birthday. She went back to that camp and got all this paper. It's pretty great. Honestly, it's so cute. No, eh. no, wrong, wrong way. Wrong way. Oh yeah, that's just the one day. Well. Damn, Ellie. Whoa. Wow. <laughs> but now hold on just a minute. You're going into space. You're gonna need a helmet. You're gonna need oh, a helmet. Right. What was I thinking? What was I thinking? Let's see which one. I kind of like this one. But let's have a little look first. Yeah, that one's boring. Um, oh. Is that all? Yeah, alright, well, it's this one then. <laughs> so cool. <laughs> How does it smell in there? Like space. And yeah, dust. Like space. <laughs> After you. Watch your head. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Damn, Joel. Okay. Calm yourself. Wow. Wow. As you look at all these buttons. Imagine just. <laughs> Happy birthday, kiddo. What is this? This is a thing that took a mighty effort to find. Take it.
Joe. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome, kiddo. <laughs> well, what do you say we uh, keep looking around, huh? That is definitely one of the best scenes, if not the best scene in part two. <laughs> she is so cute. Hey. Welcome to Earth. Yeah. God, I love Joel so much. Right, Joe, you got somewhere you want to be? Here. Come on, Joel. Nice. Big, strong man. There's more museum stuff over there. Yeah, I never checked out that building. Well, let's go. And just how do you plan on getting yourself over there? Geronimo! Ah! Ellie! <laughs> <laughs> you never give anyone else this much grief. Yeah. Get down here! No! Yeah! Hey, whose birthday is it? <laughs> you can't keep doing that. Get in I here. I want a good splash. We've got more exploring to do. Come on, Joel. Geronimo! <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> I love how we said the exact same thing. <laughs> oh, Joel. Just so, did I do okay? Oh. Hey, who's me in there? I don't know. I'll open the door for you. Come on, we can't chicken out now. Come on, man, we got more to explore. Locking the door. Well, see if you can find me another way in. I'll, I'll walk around the outside. Okay, be safe. You, you be too. Safe. <laughs> the dinosaurs are out. <laughs> God, I love Ellie so much. She's such a dog. Ah. Ooh. Stay strong, buddy. Stay strong indeed. Oh! I killed for them. And now it's going to go back into depressing sh- Ooh! Sora trading card. And a big old bison. Nice. And now depressing shit. What is this? Big horn. Alright, here we go. This guy needed a hug. Hmm. Probably more than that. It's dark in here. Yeah. Does it say woodland songbirds? Oh, shit. Biomes of North America. Uh, the woman we tortured choked on her own blood. Yeah. Oh. It's 
stragglers who snuck into camp, they just wanted food. Yeah. The kid. On, the kid who ran into the blast. I couldn't stop him. There is no light. We want to end suffering. We want to restore humanity. Each time we sacrifice part of ourselves, our leaders kept saying it will be worth it. Now we're disbanded, with nothing to show for our sins. I thought coming here might reignite something, some purpose. My parents loved bringing me here. It's one of my earliest memories from before the outbreak, before all of the cruelty and savagery. Those memories just made me angrier. I don't want to be in this world anymore. I can't look at the person I've become. Yeah. <sighs> Hello. <Stupid> big animals. <laughs> Damn. Oh, Come on, Ellie, get up. Liars. Ellie? I'm in here. How was it? Just some animal. Well, let's get a move on. I want to get a fire going before it gets too dark. Come on. So I actually just had another thought. Maybe that triggered her to want to go and find out more about the fireflies. That obviously she's read what he said and she's read that he says like, we've done all these horrible things. Whereas that's completely different to what she believed about the fireflies. And then maybe her going to find the truth about actually them found, she found the truth about what Joel did. Hmm. Well, at least she took her bag off in her sleep. And her coat. <sighs> yeah, I love that scene, but it's... it's... It's all so sad. Oh, here we go. Nice. Hey. How hot do I look right now? Pretty hot. How'd you fix it? It was a loose connection. Antenna. They found our mess at the school. Good. This guy, Owen, he went AWOL. Maybe Tommy got to him. Maybe. What about her? Nothing yet. Unit Romeo, you are requested at site two. Repeat, you are requested at site two. Confirm. So. The numbers are locations. The TV station we were at, that's six. 
There's a lot of chatter coming out of two, so I'm assuming that's their home base. That helps. Look. Last night was... stupid. Lone male trespasser. Lone male trespasser? Tommy. Tommy. Where's 14? Uh, not a hundred percent sure. Okay, then guess. Uh, if this is seven, twelve's all the way over here. I guess it's somewhere in this neighborhood. Old crest. Okay. Tina? Yeah. Not good. <laughs> hey. I'll go get him. You keep tracking them, okay? Yeah, okay. Wait. Give me your hand. It's for good luck. I don't believe in luck. I do. Oh, she's just been vomiting as well. Lovely. Is this the right place? Definitely the right place. I mean, it literally says Hillcrest right above your head. It's gotta be Tommy. Shit. I'm letting go. I'm breaking these walls down. Breaking these walls down. If you want adventure, then fly to home. But if you want to travel, then go alone. Yeah, what's the point in us if I never know? If you're gonna leave, I'ma let you go